Hey you guys, iTunes Apps here, and today I'm going to show you how to decrypt a movie and then burn that movie onto a DVD disc so you can watch it on your uh, PS3 and other stuff. So what you first want to do is uh, download this program called DVD Fab 5 and I will give you the link in the video description where you can download that. And once you've done that, go ahead and open it up. Now, this is the trial version. So, it'll give you like how many days left you have till you have to buy the full version. But go ahead and go down to DVD Fab HD Decryptor and go ahead and start DVD Fab HD Decryptor. Alright, so once you've done that, um, there's a uh, DVD to DVD and has all these different options. You go DVD to mobile, so that's only on a, the other DVD tab. So once you've done that, go ahead and uh, find a DVD you want to decrypt. And that's all you can do. Uh, I would go ahead and select the main movie. Because by doing that, it could take out, it will take out the uh, the legal stuff, which so like if you get caught, they don't have any proof, and like the option where you have to play the movie and stuff. So go ahead and insert that. All right. So once you've done that, it will open the DVD source. Alright, so once that's done uh, loading, you can see right here, here's all the uh, titles and stuff. And right down here, the movie will uh, play. Just give you a little preview. And what I like to do is go down to this one and click all of these, including English. And just leave the one up here to English and then uncheck all these. And right here is the source where the DVD is. And right there is the target, so we can want to save it. And then all you have to do is just click next. And you want to uh, check copy DVD video. And once you've done that, uh, click start. And it'll start to decrypt the uh, movie. And I've already done this, so I won't do it again. So go ahead and do that. And once that's finished, go ahead and uh, exit out of this. And. Um, Alright, so I'm going to go into my external hard drive, DVDs, and here's all the DVDs I've encrypted, I did Hancock, and here's all the files I've decrypted, there's nothing in audio, so once you've done that, here's all uh, Download a program called Nero 9. It's a trial version. I'll give you the link in the video description. And I'll give you this code where you can download the full version. So go ahead and open that up. So once that's open up, you want to go to Rip and Burn. And Burn Video Disk. Let that open up. So once that's open up, uh, it'll highlight videos slash pictures. And go ahead and select the third one, DVD video files. And this will come up, and you want to go to right here where it says add. And find the movie that you did. And you want to see how big it is, it's depending on your disk size that you will uh, copy it to. Go ahead and open that. Add. And it will add all the files here. And the screen bar says like how big the the movie is. And now what you want, now what you want to do is uh, insert a blank DVD disk. So once you've done that, you want to like I said, insert the blank DVD. 
in a total space used right here, it'll say 3,000 or how many or how big the DVD file is. And go ahead and click next. And it'll find the blank disk. I haven't inserted one because I've already done this movie. But um, this will turn like a grayish color with like no color in it until it finds a uh, blank disk. And once you've done that, I'm going to go ahead and hit burn. And it will burn the, uh, the movie onto the disk. And that is basically it. We're decrypting the movie and then putting the movie onto a disk. So you can watch it on your DVD player, PS3, all this other media stuff. And I don't want to save that. And there's like all this other stuff you can do. You can create, edit, like uh, create disc label or cover. So if like you want to sell it or something. So this part, trial version. It'll come up with this. And because if you enter your serial number, it like sometimes expires or something. But go ahead and go down here where it says entering your serial number. It's like highlighted blue. Just click on that. When that pops up, just go ahead and uh, enter the serial number, the same thing, the same number that I gave you in the video description, and that should work. And you can like create your own uh, covers for the CD, like on the front. And there's all these different options you can choose, like a standard one, like this. You can put it, so you print the uh, image and put that on the front of the disc and. That's basically it. So that is it, you guys. This is iTunes apps here. And please subscribe to my videos. Check this video out. And uh, please rate, comment, subscribe. Thanks. Oh, yeah. And um, like I said, the, uh, the license thing will expire. Here's the serial number that you entered. This one. Put it OK. And then that should do the trick. And make sure you subscribe. Thanks.